my friend recommended me as pole dancing classes and I've been coming for two years ever since. I've been pole dancing now for, ooh, I don't know, about three years. Um, I've been doing it for two years. I've been pole dancing for about two years now. Um, I've been pole dancing for just over a year now um, and I attend a class every week. I joined Nia's pole, uh, pole dancing group about a year ago now. Um, so I've been dancing for about a year and two months. Um, I've been pole dancing with Nia for about a year and a half, I think it is. I was um, asked if I wanted to take a pole dancing class uh, with a friend of mine. And initially I found it the most hysterical thing I'd ever heard of. The thought of me pole dancing was just hilarious. Um, but I went along because one of her friends had pulled out and it's the best decision that I've ever made. I first started when I moved to Wickham. I moved here on my own for a new job and I didn't know anybody. So I really wanted to find something that um, was going to be active and social that I could do. And after having a little bit of a search on the internet, I, um, I stumbled across Nia's classes. Um, so I thought, pop dancing, okay, I could give that a go, why not? I started first off with my best friend who had been pole dancing, I think, for good six months. And in those six months, she'd lost quite a lot of weight and she had toned up quite a lot as well. And I just thought, well, why not give it a go? I wanted to do pole dancing because I wanted to have a form of exercise that I'd actually want to do. I thought it'd be a bit of fun. And it is. It's everything that I expected it to be and more. Before I started, I was a little bit nervous. My first pole dancing class, I was really nervous. But when I got there, they near soon put me at ease. I was quite nervous about coming to class at first. Uh, I'd never done any kind of pole dancing. I didn't know anyone that was in my class uh, and I thought I was just going to be the worst one there and that everyone was going to be amazing. Before I joined, I was anxious about um, what the other girls in class would be like, meeting new people, not being able to do it and just um, I had visions of it being a bit um, stripper. Ish. So um, I rocked on up to my first class, not really knowing what to expect. I'm very, very nervous, not entirely sure what Nia was going to be like or what the other students were going to be like. But I was really pleasantly surprised. I mean, everybody was nervous on their first day. It was, you know, initially quite hard to get my head around the fact that I was pole dancing, and it, it, you know, it can be quite tricky when you first start. Uh, but it was really mixed ability. Everyone was working at a different level and everyone was really supportive. Uh, the fact that it was mixed stability class gave you something to work towards. You can always see the girls, there's always someone better than you and you can always work towards their level. Uh, it encourages you to come back every week and keep trying and to push, push yourself harder. I was really worried about taking up pole dancing and what everybody else would be like. Hitting middle age, I was really worried that everybody would be tall and skinny, much fitter than me. Um, but in fact, everybody was really lovely. They were all shapes and sizes, people of different ages, and everybody just made you feel so welcome and it became kind of an extended family. I wasn't sure what my instructor would be like, but to be honest, I didn't really think about it. I imagined the instructor to be some tall, leggy, blonde bimbo, high heels and skimpy little outfit. Absolutely gorgeous, feel self-conscious around them and just nervous the whole time. Tall, skinny, a little bit kind of shelfy, really dancery and stuff. With fake boobs, stripper, styly, she's completely normal, really nice, really encouraging. But I presume she'd be really, really fit, uh, flexible um, and professional. And that's what we've got. Although, yes, she is gorgeous, and he is very down to earth, and you don't feel self-conscious at all in any of her classes. It was really bubbly, really nice, really, like, sort of calming on my nerves and stuff. And she just, she knew when to push me, but then she knows when to praise as well. And is a really good um, teacher. She really breaks everything down so that you understand what you're doing and um, she's very health and safety conscientious which is good as well. Nia is um, very encouraging, she's uh, very professional about what she does. Uh, she won't let you run before you can walk. 
um, which is really good because sometimes you see what other people are doing and you really want to be able to do it but actually to take baby steps is obviously the most sensible way. You feel relaxed, she's a very patient teacher. We have a giggle, uh, no one takes themselves too seriously. Yeah, she's just, she's the perfect teacher. She just wants you to get stuck in and is really encouraging, wants you to believe in yourself and give you the confidence to know that you can do it. When I go pole dancing, I wear more gym attire, like um, a vest, like I'm wearing now. A t-shirt with just a pair of jogging bottoms. Leggings and t-shirts. Um, it's really about what you can feel comfortable in. As you move through the spins and you learn to climb, then you need to have more bare flesh available so that you can grip the pole. Shorts, so I've got a bit more skin that I can grip on with. By that point, you feel so comfortable wearing shorts around everyone that it's just not a big deal at all. We're never really down to um, underwear at all. It's not like that. It's pole fitness, not pole dancing. Pole dancing classes are great value for money and um, the hour-long classes are packed full of uh, moves and exercises so you really feel like you've done a good workout by the time you leave. Classes are good value for money. It's um, £80 for eight sessions. I think the classes are great value for money. It's cheaper for me than going to the gym and everything, although I do that on top. It's definitely worth it more than any other class and you get a really good workout all the way through. I reckon definitely get your money's worth. Nia's studio is amazing, there are four poles in total. And the studio is really good, you know, you've got the mirrors there. The best thing about the studio is having the space, and just the way it's like laid out and having our own private studio, you know that nobody else uses that place and it's just like a good little, it's like our, our little, um, little secret layer of awesomeness, I love it. I did a beginner's course uh, a year ago and um, there were eight of us in the class who had never done any pole dancing before and it was a brilliant step-by-step -step way of doing things. Um, we all started with basic spins and the sense of achievement that comes from even doing the basic things is amazing. You just never think that you're going to be able to do what other people can do and when you find yourself doing it, it's, it's you just want to jump up and down and, and just go way, you know, I've done it, I've done it, I can actually do what these people can do and you just feel great about yourself. It's just such an amazing achievement. Three reasons why I like pole dancing the most. One, it's a fantastic workout. Um, it's great for cardio, great for strength and flexibility. It's structured just like a workout class. You have a warm up, you have a cool down at the end. Uh, everyone's like a little community. Um, but you get a workout as well. I've grown in strength uh, and in confidence in myself. And it's the one activity I've stuck to. Uh, I don't get on very well in gyms and I don't find uh, exercise very easy. But pole dancing is such good fun and very varied that you just don't get the boredom factor with it. I think the best thing about pole dancing is that you don't really know that you're doing exercise. You know, it's just such a, you know, so much fun while you're doing it. You're doing something that's really good and healthy for you and kind of really working on your, your, your strength and, and flexibility, but actually it doesn't feel like an exercise class. It's, my strength and flexibility has improved tenfold. I've been doing it for two years and it just can, keeps on improving every single week after week after week. She's always putting on new workshops, new classes. There are plenty of pole jams which means that everybody who attends a class at the studio can come and have fun and practice the moves that they know. The best thing about pole dancing is definitely the confidence piece. Um, I love going upside down, doing the inverts and things like that. That's really, really like the most exciting bit about it. Um, and also it's really good for building up your upper body strength and I um, found that, you know, I felt really fit from doing it and felt really good. Each lesson I learned something new, which is what I really, really enjoy, is like learning, 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 learning and getting it right and practicing, practicing, practicing until I get it right. So um, I really feel like it's um, a really good hobby and I do really, really enjoy it. The thing that pole dancing has given to me is more confidence. I'm more happy about myself as a woman. I'm more happy generally in myself. I'm much more uh, flexible, more fit than I used to be. Uh, I've discovered muscles that I never knew existed. 
it's just good when you finally crack a move that you've been trying for a long time, you crack it, it's like, yeah, yeah, everybody's really encouraging claps and it's like, yay. Um, second reason why I love it, again, the teacher is awesome. Nia knows how to make it quite fun and interesting. Nia's lovely, she, uh, she's great fun. We have such a laugh every week. Uh, she's she's a really good friend. She's not just an instructor, but she's a good friend to everyone as well. But Nia is lovely. She's really sweet and she's such a good teacher. And it's really good having somebody that's so enthusiastic about pole dancing. She's just really down to earth. Yeah, just, just a really good instructor. Third reason why I love it is all the rest of the girls that are here. It's great fun to be with them all. I've met the most amazing people ever that we have. Really good time, really good friends. I come religiously every week and I love it. I love all the girls who uh, dance with us. Um, we have a really good social sign as well. We go out in the evenings, we have fun. and We do pole shoots, we've even been on holiday to do pole. It's just, it's nice to be a part of something. I absolutely love it. I've met some amazing people. The social side is brilliant. Everybody's really encouraging in class and it's just a really good confidence boost, which is what I needed. Everyone's like a, a really nice big family now. I didn't know anybody in Wickham and I've just made so many friends from this. It just does feel like a big family. I spend as much time down here as possible because uh, people here are like my second family. And we just get on, give each other confidence and make each other feel worthwhile, really. And just have great fun. You just feel like you're almost like you're going out to lunch with the girls and you've got the banter, you've got the camaraderie, you've got the support in and outside of the classes. It's basically like a little community and it's just tons of fun. It's really nice to be in a group of women and just like sort of like bonding with other women and I've made some really nice friends. It's brilliant, I love it. Everybody I've met through the pole dancing studio has just become an instant friend and it binds everybody together. We go out socially and we have get-togethers here at the studio and it's become a huge part of my life. It's just loads of fun, having a load of fun with some friends and a bit of a giggle at the same time. Great, I recommend pole dancing to everybody out there and I love it. I would rather be pole dancing, so see you later.